Flinders University is set to play its part in transforming one of Adelaide's oldest industrial sites into a state-of-the-art teaching and research facility with a $120 million investment at Tonsley Park. The university, already the largest single employer in southern Adelaide, will further expand its presence with a new facility in which to teach engineering, computer science and mathematics. Flinders Vice-Chancellor Professor Michael Barber and the Premier Jay Wetherill made the historic announcement at the old Mitsubishi site. I was uh, thrilled when I heard the, the news that Flinders University is making this tremendous investment. So we are in moving, or proposing to move as the Premier said, the School of Computer Science, Engineering and Maths down onto this campus. The new Flinders building will also incorporate the university's research and commercialisation expertise in medical technology and nanotechnology. It will also be home to the Southern Knowledge Transfer Partnership, which has produced such initiatives as the Science and Maths Academy, which gives Year 12 students the opportunity to study on campus. It's a very significant investment in a critical area of the state's requirements in engineering, ICT, and science-related activities around the transformation of the state. Initially, the proposal will involve moving the School of Computer Science, Engineering and Mathematics to Tonsley. Uh, the bulk of engineering beyond year two will occur at Tonsley Park. The potential on the site for programs like medical devices is quite significant. It is an interesting co-location. We tend to think of it as Flinders University and Tonsley Park but in the close proximity is Flinders Medical Centre and the REPAT. And so the sorts of industries that I think will come up on the park are ones that do try and play off those three areas. And medical devices is a very significant program for us now and one that I think can play a very significant part in the future of Tonsley Park and the South here. Design work is already underway for the new facility that will house about 2,000 students and 150 staff from 2015. Future student accommodation will be considered for the site as Flinders continues to grow. It's certainly the first step in a longer term commitment to the park. Uh, the government's uh, plan for the park has three stages and we would anticipate that as that unfolds over the next 10 or 15 years, Flinders' uh, contributions to it and our participation in it will actually grow. The development at Tonsley Park is certainly a significant investment by Flinders. It will impact upon choices that we make in the future. However, there is still capacity for us to continue to develop uh, Bedford Park. And in fact, it is imperative that we do continue to develop Bedford Park. So I think my message really to the university has threefold. This is an exciting opportunity for which engineering is the first area to work out how it can engage, but by no means the only one. There is great opportunities in other areas. Secondly, it is not a turning our back on the hill, but in fact is taking many of our expertise into a new commitment in the region. And thirdly, for most people, over the next two to three years, there really is no reason to do anything except continue to do what people do very well. Teach well, carry out research, and continue their commitment, which I know they have, to making Flinders the university we all aspire it to be. The new Tonsley Park development will be linked by frequent bus services to the main Flinders campus. We will in fact design our timetables in such a way that student and staff interaction between uh, Bedford Park and Tonsley are as easy as possible. Longer term, I would hope that we will see the Darlington transport study brought to fruition the idea of light rail coming from Tonsley Park up to the campus would be a significant um, advantage uh, to the south. It would allow us to put considerable more infrastructure, student potentially student housing and other facilities on the Tonsley Park. Uh, that, however, is something that probably is several, if not uh, closer to five to ten years away. Meanwhile, we will try and integrate the, the campus here at Bedford Park and uh, Tonsley as closely as we can.